Hey everyone, in today's quick Photoshop video, I wanna show you how to create heart shapes inside of Photoshop. There's a really, really easy way to do it. I know tutorials walk you through creating a shape from scratch, but Photoshop actually has heart shapes built in and you have multiple different options. Let me show you right now. As usual, if it's your first time here, I make these type of videos every single week on this channel. So consider subscribing. And I do have a link to the latest version of Photoshop in the description below if you don't have it. So it's really simple. First thing, let's go ahead and go to file and go to new and just create a document if you don't have one open yet. So I'm just gonna create one of these documents from my recent list, but these are my settings of a typical document. And I could just leave it with a transparent background and I'll create it. So here to add a heart shape, if we go over here and select this option and look at all these different shape tools, we won't see a heart shape. So typically the videos you'll see, they use the ellipse tool here and make a heart shape with layering multiple ellipses on top of each other. But there are more shapes than what you see here. Let me show you where to find them. Come up here to Windows and then go to the Shapes window right here. Open this up. And with this window open, let me show you, let me bring it over here and expand it so you could get a better look. There is something if you scroll down of the different shapes you'll see called legacy shapes. These are the shapes that have been on Photoshop for a long time. And if you expand it, you'll see a bunch of different options over here. And if you go down, playing cards has a heart in it. And there's another option if I keep going under shapes too, you'll see a heart shape here too. You'll see multiple different heart shapes over here. So all you have to do is select one of them and then you could go ahead and drag it over here and you get a heart. Now the color of the heart is based on your foreground color over here. So if I undo this here, I could go ahead and change the color, the foreground color to red, for example, if I wanna make a red heart, I'll go to red right here and I'll press okay. So now you see my foreground color is red. Now, if I select this heart and click over here, drag and drop, there you go. Now I could go ahead and resize this any way I want. I could go ahead and hold shift and change the aspect ratio of it to be more squeezed or bigger. And you have other hearts too. So you got this one. Let me just press check mark on this one. I'll drag this one over. There we go. We got this kind of heart where the center of it is open. And let me show you the playing card heart. It looks a little bit different. So you can see different shape there. So those are the three different heart shapes. And there are a ton of other legacy shapes over here that you could go ahead and try out the same way if you didn't know about this option. But for the sake of this video, we just wanted the heart option and we have it. Three different kinds of hearts you could choose from there. I hope you found this quick video useful. Please give it a thumbs up, subscribe for easy to follow videos on creative tools just like Photoshop, and I'll see you next time.